I picked up the Becca Ultimate Coverage 24 Hour Foundation. And this is what it looks like. This is the bottle. I picked up the shade, I think Olive, right? Yep, Olive. And it's so cute. Um, she did swear by this. So I'm going to just swatch it on the back of my hand just to show you. I just love how this is very like sleek and elegant looking. Um, but this is just so moisturizing. This, I think, would be a great foundation for fall and winter because of how moisturizing it is. It just feels like a tinted moisturizer. But it's going to have, obviously, more coverage than tinted moisturizer. Um, this is from Ofer Cosmetics. Look at this color. Oh my gosh. What else? And they call it Miami Fever, but they really should have like called this something that has to do with fall. Because this just looks like pumpkin and cinnamon spice look at this i'm gonna swatch this even though i just washed my hands off but that's all right i just want you to see how beautiful and stunning this color is look at that gorgeous it's gonna be gorgeous on the lips can't wait can't wait what else did i pick up oh i picked up this from dermalogica now i see who is it that I saw using this? Vanity Beauty, is that the name of her? Um, but I love her. She's a makeup artist from California. And she's the first person that I've ever seen use this product. It's the Hydro Blur Primer. Blur fine lines and pores, all of which I need. Um, hydrate and brighten for naturally flawless skin. Lightweight, non-greasy. Minimizes the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. Mattifies against oily shine and imparts a silky, luminous finish. Yes! So that's all about what I need to do with my life. And look how cool is that? They actually give you like a squeezy thing so that you can make sure you get all of your product, okay? I'm all for that. Thanks for not trying to rip us off, Dermalogica. And this is what it looks like in the tube. Very sleek and skinny. You know, I like all products that are sleek and skinny. But, um, yeah, I can't wait to give this a try. I really have never used this before, but I do see other people use it. And it looks like something that, you know, I could benefit from. So that's why I picked this up. Next skincare product, I got the... I got the CeraVe gel oil. Now, I don't know what it is or what everybody's doing, but I noticed that a lot of the YouTube videos that I watch, everybody's skin is just like so amazing and super shiny. So um, I'm thinking that maybe if I alternate my evening moisturizer with this, and CeraVe is a brand that is so great because it's amazing for all skin types and um, it's non commodogenic meaning that it won't clog your pores or anything like that. So it says this one instantly improves skin radiance, right? And we could all use um, some skin radiance in the fall and winter months because it's so drying. Even in the summer too, you know? And it says it has a Ceraplex, a unique five ceramide and sunflower blend. Um... What is this going to do? Apparently there's a whole line of this stuff. Non-comedogenic, won't clog pores, and offers intense hydration, gentle on the skin, not irritating, and fragrance free to avoid fragrance irritation. So I would think this would be excellent. Um, maybe the whole line might be excellent. Looks like it comes with a uh, serum. A daily cream and a night cream this sounds like this would be pretty excellent for anyone with sensitive skin and dry skin and uh, you know especially people with sensitivities that need to stay away from a lot of chemicals that a lot of products really contain um, CeraVe is where it's at okay the last thing that I picked up um, which I'm sure a lot of people it's not new to anybody but it's new to me this is the Huda Beauty 3d highlighter palette like look at this how stunning this is we have to open this product on camera so i'm just gonna take this off get rid of that look how beautiful huda just does such a great job with everything that she puts out i really just love her stuff and i know there's a lot of drama on youtube about this and that i i don't care i don't care that ain't got nothing to do with me 
Fiji's this color right here. So we're just gonna, ooh, oh yes. Let's just, look at that, it's so pretty. Oh, thank you guys so much for hanging with me to the end of this. I hope that you've seen some things that might inspire you to go and check them out. And um, give a thumbs up for my first YouTube video. It's so random that I would just post this, but I've wanted to share for such a long time. If you guys like this type of video, if you liked it from me, then let me know. Leave a comment down below on what was your favorite item that I showed and displayed and let me know what some of your items are. I'd love to check them out. So thanks again for hanging out with me and see you guys next time. Bye!